I've always wanted to be in one of these. Oh my God. Woo. Fucking hobby steer. for something different yes we don't know what to expect but i'm pretty bloody excited because pretty sure it's going to be amazing because this whole area is epic and today actually today will end in a beautiful beautiful station but we're not going to tell you where yet until we get there <laughs> we've just said it before we have already damn it <laughs> we have already another thing before we crack on before <laughs> we crack on and show, show you this amazing drive make sure you subscribe so pause the video now hit that little subscribe button if you haven't done it already especially if you're loving our videos. It's but. free, but you know what? It helps us out, so it means we can keep pumping out these videos for you guys. And we will, and we want to. A bowl of your mom. Woohoo! So A of your mom. And I love you Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> Get you can always turn it around. Oh, I, I, I shouldn't have met you, I only let you down. Oh, now I, in your bedroom, my thoughts were thinking loud. Oh, I, I shouldn't have met you. There's all these little dips and you would be traveling along at 80 and luckily my brakes are on point at the moment. Luckily. All the dust gets in there and scores them and makes them really good. Um, yeah, I just have to push real hard, but yeah, old Maxi, you get thrown forward, don't you? Well, you don't really get much notice, do you? Like, hold on! Yeah, I know, just hold on! <laughs> that one was okay, but... The last few, like, my head nearly hit the Oh, room. mate. What does mum say when there's a, when we hit a bump? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> What's this sign? Uh, this must be a Shire sign. Yeah, welcome to uh, Central Darling Shire. Unsealed so, road drive to condition. So I don't know what that makes this. So we back in. Oh, you know what this is? This would be Burke. This is Burke. You can see the difference in the way that it's all being graded. They grade a lot wider here, don't they? Yeah, it looks like it's freshly, pretty freshly graded here, and they're still working on it. They're definitely still yeah, working a, on it. Yeah, it's a really wide road. Yeah, it's crazy. It's up here. It's just, just a random tractor. And the um, notice how the ground's a lot softer now. Look at this. It's like it's all powder. I'm not driving in sand. Look at this. I'm just swerving all over the joint. I'm not even. I'm not meaning to do this. Hang on, I gotta do. I gotta show. I'm not meaning. I honestly not meaning it. It's like catching. Look at that. The back kicks out. Look at this. It is so soft. Oh my god. I'm gonna stop here. Yeah. Oh jeez. Look at that. Honestly. Oh yeah, look at all of them just behind it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As soon as we crossed into Berkshire, I think this is Berkshire. Look, it's so hard to control the, the car in it. Like it doesn't look that bad, but. Yeah, it looks smooth. It yeah, actually looks smooth. Obviously our tire pressure's over 55. Yeah, okay. But we've experienced nothing like this. I think they've graded it too deep and now it's turned it into like the road we're just on was compact. Yeah, that was fun. This actually looks compact and still until you start um, oh, driving on it. I can't fucking hardly steer. 
So what are we going to do? It's completely changed. Like it, it's been rock solid. Now we've got this stuff. Look at that. She's just, just soft, soft powder. And it just keeps going. It's because they've graded all of this. And during, on this whole road, like you've seen the last trip from well, Kenya to um, Tilpa, um, it was nothing like this. Um, yeah, it's just interesting to see the difference yeah. between the shires. Like the, how much more they're grading it. What but then that smell? Sorry. I hope it's not you. <laughs> Can you smell that? I've got a little it, bit it of It was BO. like as soon as it came in the car, <laughs> it was like got a big whiff of something. I don't think I smell that bad, do I? Yeah, well, I don't, are you wearing deodorant? I'm not wearing deodorant. Probably I'm not. not. Well, I haven't showered in. We haven't showered in. Yeah, but we're, we've been swimming in the Darling. Getting, I'm nearly getting Ever watched Twister? Are you seriously gonna run in that? Mate, well, look, it's coming our way though. Look, well, maybe we'll put the combi in it. What? Oh, here it comes. Look. Windows down, this is gonna be sick. Are you look at it? Windows up. Nah, nah. Do you want me to run out there? Oh my gosh. Um, thongs. Babe, you need boots. Do you know how spiky that's gonna be? No idea. Um, grab that camera. Let's go. Look at this, guys. <laughs> It's a twister! Oh my god! Yes! Yes! I've always wanted to be in one of these! Look at this! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, I'm in it! I'm in it! Holy dooly! Oh my god! Woo! Woo! <laughs> Look at this! Oh, oh, that was the coolest thing ever. I got shit all through my feet. Oh, that was, I don't, I don't know if you could hear the wind on that, but, oh. I love the movie Twister. I was in the eye of the storm then. That was rad. <laughs> That's still going. <laughs> oh my yes How was that? Did you see that? You looked crazy. You couldn't even um you probably can't see that far could you? Yes I could. It's pretty loud in there. <laughs> my toes like? are so itchy. What was it like? Just windy. But could you feel like Yeah, yeah, force? yeah, yeah, you could feel the wind going round and then it was sort of not moving in the middle wow. but it was moving so fast those bushes out there are incredibly spiky and I knew it I knew it as soon as as soon as you said you're gonna do that I was like that is gonna be so I would have missed it if I put shoes on oh, that's tick for me I've always wanted to do that oh great you know that's probably about <laughs> but I'm glad you got it done babe oh do you maybe should, should we wait for another one and you can have a run no I'm good you're good, right? Thanks. We'll keep moving. You've, uh, you've ticked that one off for the whole fam. Yeah. Maybe Ollie can do it. Ollie maybe. can maybe do it. Maybe if Ollie and that see it. Oh my God, I'm honestly my feet. They are stinging. I could have predicted this for you. 
but they, it didn't sting when I was doing it. Yeah, because it? of the adrenaline. Yeah, That's true. what it is, the adrenaline. You were so excited, you weren't thinking about that. I don't know what those plants are. Yep. My feet are absolute stinging. Mm -hmm. Keeping an eye out for a twist on Max. I'm twi I'm booked on twisters now. That was wild, honestly. Can we be storm chasers? Um. <laughs> the Ocker. We'll just set the Ocker up like they do that. on Twister, and we'll just hunt storms. I'm you know, not interested in that. You can do that. Oh. that could do be we have any um, stop sting or stop itch or something? Somewhere. No, no word of a lie. It's... You'll be right, babe. You'll be right. Are they, is it stinging nettle or is it some sort of stinging plant? Because honestly, my feet are in agony. Or do you think it was so many little pro little spikes? It was like <laughs> like needle treatment. Don't know. I don't know. <laughs> oh, that's heavy melted. Other arm. Yep, you good. Thank you. Yep, plenty. There we go. See. Okay. Good girl. There you go, Bob. I already got it on. I already got it on, Bob. I don't care that I don't care that we don't shower. We've just got to wear deodorant, alright? I'm fine. Oh, I for forgot the snowy, I forgot. Yeah, see Zuri just said he smells. Yeah, sorry mate. Do I smell better now? Yeah. Thanks, buddy. I dare you. Run out again. Go for it, babe. I'm You're going, on. I'm going to. Go. I'm going to. I'm going to. I just need. That is a marathon. That's really far away. I know. And I'm wearing. Go. I'm, go. I'm, go. I'm, I'm, no, no, no. Because he's moving towards me. That's a long way away, hey. Yep. You're, right. babe, you always tell me you're an athlete. I am an athlete. You're I'm, always telling me you're, you're an athlete. You're on. You're on. Holy. It is moving. No, I'm going to have to get up here ahead of it. He's a man. What they do, so I'll see it in storm hunters. Oh. Storm hunters, yeah, or whatever they call it, they get ahead of it. Wow, listen to him talking like he knows what he's talking about. Oh, it is moving, I can't even run that fast. Wow. Can you see it? Yeah, I can That's see it. That's monstrous, like it goes. It goes right up in the sky. I feel like I need to get our big camera out and zoom in so I can show you guys. Oh. So Carson's gonna grab this. Oh my god, how am I gonna run out? You there? need to just speed up ahead. I'm gonna have to. Run. Who's this? Twisters, baby! Twisters, baby! There it is, there. I reckon. You're on, you're on, babe, you're on. Oh, mate, that is moving. That I is feel moving. like you're making excuses right now. Go! Oh, come on. Oh, Max, that's a long way. I'm not gonna make it. Oh, they're spiky again. It was a lot further away than I thought. Oh, I'm slow now. I haven't done cardio in so long. Oh, I don't know if I was worth doing. Oh. Oh, God. Nearly there. It stopped. Are you serious, mate? Oh, no. Look at them all. Oh, no. This is it here. Oh, are you serious? Oh, mate. Oh, now it's picked up. I can't even see the combi. Fire out. <clears throat> 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 
Mate, my lungs are killing me. Mate, I turned around, I couldn't, I could hardly see the combi. I didn't realise it was like, it was like nearly a K. Well, we were worried and then Zuri said to me, Mum, I'm worried, where's Dad? And, and then I tried to get the camera out to zoom in. And, and the, you didn't know where it was? No, the battery was exhausted, so I couldn't oh, zoom in. It's all right. I need binoculars. Well, you know what, the, what, the, what happened? What? As soon as I got about 10 metres away from it, it stopped. <gasps> so what'd you do? Just walked back. No way. But luckily, look, see there's another one there. Yeah. Two more came through on the walk back, so. Oh, wow. Yeah. Do you want an ice cold drink? Max, that's mind blowing, isn't it? Yeah. It I've, kind of. I've never seen anything like that. It's I've really never, cool to see. I've never seen that. I'm actually excited to look back on the footage of you in it because it'd be cool to see what it looks like up close. It was windy. It was windy. Yes. Were you ever scared? No, like it's not like it's gonna pick you up. It's not like full blown twister. Well, you got a spider web or something on your face. <sighs> Did you run through a spider web? Oh, I doubt it. Probably, it was in the air getting thrown around as well. Look at that one. That's a big one. Yeah, I wish well. that was the one. Woo! Let's go, Zoo. Flies are out of control, aren't Let's they? Go. Come on. Can I take this? Yep. I think we're about 20 minutes away from Laos. Now, Laos is a cool, it's a really small town. It's just got a pub. Very oh. basic. I think it's, I think it has it has more of a population than Tilba. Yeah, it's tiny though. It's tiny. It's tiny um, as any. Will the pub be open? Who Probably knows? not. Well, oh well. look, our first bit of traffic. He didn't really slow down for me. <laughs> he just dusted us. Oh. Woo! Oh, that's beautiful. Nice little wetland. That'd be God, nice. Look how green it is over here. Oh look, you see a little mouse, there's a mouse rat running down there. Really? Yeah. That's beautiful. Can you see any fish in there, Zuri? Yeah. Let me wipe the window down a little bit more. It looks a bit stagnant though, that yeah, water. Yeah, it is, isn't it? A bit pongy. Where did it go? We're on a bit of a time frame, aren't we? What do you mean? As far as getting home. Oh yeah, we are, we are. Because obviously, I think we mentioned it in um, a couple of other episodes, but we're heading back to Newcastle. We've got a property there that we're going to do a three month reno on, or hopefully three months. Turn it into an Airbnb, so, so if you're in Newcastle. And so our tenants actually move out on the 6th of April. So um, that's our time limit to get in, get it done, and then get it up on Airbnb. So we can travel for longer and just make a bit more money. By the time this episode goes up, it's probably going to be the 6th of April, if not <laughs> past that. So we're home, probably, by this point, renoing. Oh, um, wishing that we're in the outback. Wishing, wishing that we were right here. You know, this is going to be our motivation because this is what we love doing. And the reason why we're going back to Newcastle is so we can just keep doing what we love to do. Then the Oka is delivered in June. Yes. Hopefully by now, by the time this goes up live on YouTube, that we've got... Um, We'll have some footage of the uh, an update an update on the Oka, so we'll ho hopefully have a video on that up pretty soon. Um, yeah, then baby pops out, and then we hopefully hit the road. It's going to be such a busy year, but I'm looking forward to it all. Lots of challenges, lots of projects. Like there's a lot going on, yeah. and you know you can look at it in two different ways. You're like, oh my god, we've got so much to do, or you can look at it as like, oh my god, there's it's really exciting. It's really exciting. Can't yeah. wait to get all this all this hard work done. But I think it's one of those mindsets, and it's so easy to sort of get into is looking on the negative sides of things if you're in a bit of a bad mood sometimes. And I feel like I always try and look at the positive. Oh, That's just the way I've always been. Sweet don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I still have my, you know, I still have my days. Um, <laughs> Especially with the pregnancy hormones. Well, she's on fire lately. <laughs> but life is a mindset, 100%. 100%. And everyone feeds off each other's energy. And because we travel, a lot of people say, how do you travel together so closely all the time? Well, I guess yeah. it's, it's like we're, we're very, very much aware of each other. You'll always find a thousand reasons to not do something, but there's equally a thousand reasons to do it. So if you're sitting at home, and you're going, God, I, I wish we could go out there and one day we will, one day. Do it. Don't say one day. Make a date. Yeah. Write it down. Tell as many people as you can. And then you become accountable. And then you have to do it. Because no one wants to be a shit talker. 
okay? No one wants to be like, he's a gunner, gunner guy. You don't want to be that guy or that gal. So. Because in the end, guys, none of us know we're all going to die, right? That's the only guarantee. None, none of that us. That sounds tacky, but it is literally the only guarantee. But none we're of us. We're all going to die. Okay. <laughs> what I was trying to say is. Yeah. <laughs> Righto, mate, calm down. What I was trying to say is none of us actually know how much time we have, so you've got to make the most of the time that you do have. And that's a big priority for us, time. Time is everything. Money can be made. You can always make money time later. Time can't be bought, guys. So just get out there and live your life. Plenty of work on the road. We've said it before. A thousand different ways to make money on the road. Just get creative and get out here and see the country because you're not going to be laying there on your deathbed regretting it, are you? But you're going to regret it if you're sitting there working your ass off for the next 60 years and then you can't do what you want to do. So anyway, that's our little bit of motivational talk. We don't do that often, but if we can inspire at least one of you to get out there and book that trip, book that trip, lock in that adventure, whatever it is, and you then know our what? job is done. Like I'm stoked with that. It also doesn't have to be. It doesn't have to be a long-term trip. Just those small little trips can be enough as well. If that's all you can fit in. Hey, that was a good advice, I think. Oh, uh, uh, you know what? I would like to hear that. If my younger self would love to. That advice. Oh yeah, if you are younger, <laughs> there's yeah. knuckling down, yeah. working your butt off real hard early is also a very good idea. 100%. Because then you can get that property, you can you can build up some assets. We're not saying just don't work and just travel. It's about work hard for as short amount of time as you can, so then you can enjoy your time for as long as time as you can. Right, babe. Yeah. Found that. Anyway, back to the road. Yep. There's a boat up there on the grass. Wow. That's how high it was. What the? What the? That water is high. Look, look, he saved that. Does he? Yeah. Look how lush that is. Oh, oh. my God. That is beautiful. Yeah. It looks open to me. Uh, um, do I get my hat here? That's an open sign. Oh. Open your door? It's open, that's good. Good job. Open is good. Cheers. Cheers, mate. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers, mate. over the oh. other side of the pub there. Yeah, there's a free spot over the other side of the pub. 
Um, you've got the face tree and a few other things, but it's getting a bit late in the day and um, road closed due to local rain. Yeah, oh. it hasn't rained, but it's not closed. Anyways, like Carsten said, the day is getting on, so we're heading to Rose Isle Station. Really excited to take you guys there and show you around, but also we're pumped. I think we're going to spend a couple of days there. Two days, this. maybe three, I think we've Who got to stop. Just chill out. Chill out, reflect. Yeah. To enjoy ourselves. Red dirt. Yeah. Our favourite. Pardon? <laughs> Are you eating yogurt, you crazy kid? Hey, don't play with your food. Use your spoon. Use your spoon. Are you, are you a baby? Are you a baby? Look, everyone on YouTube is watching you eat like a baby. Are you going to eat like a big three year old? Where's my three year old? That was did she have a smile on her face? Well, that? it was a mixture, I don't really know. Don't know what was going on there. Look at this. Bulldust. We only just bought it. And you and you threw it out the window. I'm doing it. There it is, I can see it too. And you've done it in the most bulldusty spot. We can't yeah. lose the hat. But we did it. No, we did it. So what do you gotta do? Leave it on your head. Oh. Look at this stuff. Red soil. Red bull dust. Can you hold that for a sec? You want to see bull dust? Here comes a big train, big road train. What's this thing? Lots of dust and lots of rust. Mel, there's plenty of good things here. 
here at the homestead um, and then the camping you can camp ages down that way all along the river there's lots of really nice um, you know secluded camp spots all the way down that way or you can stay close to here and there's like a camp kitchen and stuff but you know we'll, we'll show you all that very 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 soon our bookings and actually remember the last time we were here they were working on the cabin I was stuff, just thinking remember? and they were also working on the the faraway campsites they were working on um, putting in some good toilets in there as well and the oh, barbs was it the, like the glass uh, yeah yeah. Well, yeah we'll show them well, we'll show you guys you have to wait and see let's see if they recognize the noise hi <laughs> She could hear the comments. I could hear you coming. I could hear you coming. I'll get Siri out. Hello! Hi! Hello! How are you? She's so big, big girl now. Come say hello. She what? knew you and your baby. It's, right. it's okay. Yeah. Lovely to see you. I believe it. Still going. Mate, it's been halfway, it's been around Australia. <laughs> We're on the way home. Oh, really? Yeah. Do I have kids? Yeah. This is my little shop. You got a shop now? Of course you do. What else would I do? Yeah. Wow, you have so much so much time. Oh yeah, we so much time. So I laid the floor and then we did. Oh, this is great. Because it's winter time. Oh no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kind of, it's a station. This is called a station. Hey, who found that? Uh, Sam's going to show us round. Because I guess the thing is, a lot of people who are travelling don't always have accommodation. They don't always have their tents. They actually want something. They want something to stay in, and this is great. Yeah. Or if you've been travelling for a long time, sometimes you just want a break. Like rainwater. Hello. Wash your hair in rainwater. Oh. Wow. Yes. <laughs> we shouldn't be looking at this. Yeah. Can we stay in here? No, we're going to stay in the combi, bub. No, so do these book out Wait. over winter? These will get booked out pretty quick in well, advance. We've had summer. We've oh, really? Left oh, this is this this is the floor I remember last yeah. time we were here. Oh, this is great. This is great. I remember this one. And so all done. This is big bed. Oh, so cozy. Oh, and more. Yeah. Okay, so this sleeps one, two, one three, one four, five. The other one has a twin room. Yes, but then that opens up to the other side as well, so a full-blown family can get in here. Mate, and this one is no reason not to hit the Darling River run. No reason. Call these guys up, book in, hit the road, and come see this joint. Is. Lots of history here. So cool. Yeah, go for it. Yeah, go for it. No, no, leave them. We just had leftovers and wasn't it good? Oh, relax, green, green grass. Chriso is rocking up right now. I'm excited to see <coughs> what he thinks. <clears throat> For all you caravanners. Hi, 
How was that? I didn't think we'd be driving on the beach for 50 k's. Oi. <laughs> wasn't it? Was, was it? Wasn't it like oh. this? Mate, the combi, the combi was just, was just, like, yeah, was just tail whipping the whole way down there. We so it was okay for caravans, is what yeah, you're saying. Yeah, good. Yeah. yeah. But it's just like you're driving on the beach. How was the bull dust at the end? The red uh, stuff. Right. Bello, did you put the drone up? We did at some stage. Yeah, we took it up. We tried to go through one of those spin effects whirlies. Did you see? I ran out there. I ran a yeah. k. I've yeah. been coughing up for the last yeah. hour because my, my lungs oh, are hurting. Fast, eh? <clears throat> Mate, it was the dustiest yeah. road I've ever driven on. It, it's sandy, eh? It felt sandy for you? No, bull dust. We found like it was just so sandy. I was, I was yeah, yeah, it's like, it's like, it's like yeah, sandy, but bull dust yeah. is harder than sand. Oh, look at the dust. <laughs> For a long time, it's going to turn on. So, uh, I'm going to say, and oh, who am I? I got this feeling, love is in season. Let's stick a drive down to a place where affection grows. Sign your name, a man shakes your hand and a kiss Ooh, we're the same Our lives begin that day Beautiful morning here at Rose Isle, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. And check this out. Fire, coffee. Oh. I'm super chilled. Like, I haven't been this relaxed in ages. We even sat on a lounge. I like that's that. what it is. You haven't sat like that on a lounge for who knows how long. So be able to, and in front of a fire, mind you. Well, and, you, and you're wearing a jumper and trackies, which... It's lovely. Which, you know, we haven't had the pleasure of doing in a while. So I think all of these little creature comforts are quite good. That's, that's the beauty of life on the road. When you actually get to experience these, like you said, creature comforts, you really, really soak them up. Mm. Uh, we're also going to jump on a buggy. Um, the three of us are going to jump on a buggy. We're going to go for a burn around the property to show mm -hmm. you guys all the different campsites. So I think there's like, I'm just going to make this number up, 15. We'll let you know. <clears throat> 15 campsites down the river. So, there, you know, if you don't want to be here amongst the busyness, um, where, you know, in this beautiful area well, here, yeah. you can you can have your own little patch of paradise down the, down the river there. But and we'll show you those I later. I was going to say as well, Sam, who runs this place, is really excited because she's got flushable toilets yeah, there's over a few, there. There's They've a done few, a lot. There's a few flushable toilets down there by the river, um, plus a very unique um, experience, which we'll show you. I think it's finished. It's where the bath is. I don't know. Very if it Instagrammable. Is. I reckon that's going to be the new Instagram thing you're going to see on bloody on there, and everyone's going to go, "Oh my god, can't wait to get that photo." <laughs> Got to go there to get the photo. Anyway, we'll go there. We'll get the bloody photo, won't we? Where are we going? Where? What are we going to go ride on? A buggy. A buggy. Let's do this. Do you know what you're doing? Look, mate. <laughs> right, in you get Zuri. Sure. Hang on. Dad, I'm on the slower stage. There you go. Mm -hmm. We're off. We're out of here, babe. We're out of here, Zuri. Yeah. 
is down here now it's beautiful like these are all camp spots guys so you can camp down here on the grass there's the the darling right there you've got your own fire pits this is heaps of timber around this is super secluded so if you want your own little camp here. we're not we're, we're just not showing camping them. mate we're just we're showing doing? everybody See these guys in here we're showing them guys if you want to here's a cool camp spot pretty cool huh we're just showing them around can we go to the camp spot here? Yeah, let's go. Let's go look at for another one. Um, to the left. Uh, yes. It's all overgrown, so it's hard to oh, see it's the road. Oh, bloody beautiful! Oh my god! Where are we gonna park up? Yeah, stop here. Stop. That'll do. So you've got a campsite down there, yeah, right? So you can come here with swags, or you don't need to be all self-contained because. You have a toilet. And not only do you have a toilet, you have a shower. But not only do you have a shower, this bath is about to go in here. Look at this. I'm so excited about this. This is absolutely gonna be so spectacular. And Sam, Imagine sitting in here having a bath. Wow, oh, so, so what Sam's yeah, idea was the light. The so light beautiful, huh? Here. Yeah, but there's the shower. Oh, Could look, you imagine oh, look at this for a bottle. That is cranking. That is so good. This? Having a bath in here like this? Yeah. Be lovely. Mum would love that. Ne Ma Max, next time we're here, we're camping at this campsite and we're staying in this bath. With a baby. With the baby. <laughs> With the baby. Okay. Let's have a look over here. Come on, what have we got? A shower. I'm sure it's just a shower. Lockable. All right, there you go. Oh, this cool. Is cool. Okay. Hey, look. Shower with the stars, shower with the sun. Here. That's just the toilet, I'd say. That's a flushable one. Let's test it. Oh, wow. It's tidy oh. as. Here we go. Flushes. Cracker. That was Sam's one thing on the property. She said, no, 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 no. Like, she lives out in the bush, but she's like, I need a flushable toilet. So I want the people that stay on my property to have one too. Have one too? Yeah. How good's that? You can get a little feel of this too, Closer. Perfect, that nailed it. Zoo and I had the best time, didn't we? How do you reckon Mum's going to go at the ocker? Yeah, we have one of the tickets. Oh, we'll have one of these as well. Yeah, no one to do that. You want to tip it over? Yeah. Probably wouldn't. <laughs> no, it's going to be so fun. Oh, good. But the cool thing was seeing um, 
how bloody green it was. Oh, unbelievable. I think the last time we drove out there um, was with oh, James and Becky in the combis. Remember how it was just brown dust? Yeah, and I don't know if we'll get to, oh, for a very long, it's probably gonna be a long time oh, before we get there. to see it like this again. So I was soaking it up. Yeah, yeah, it was freaking amazing. You say bye, Sam. Bye, Sam. Sam! Sant! Sant! <laughs> Bye, Sam! Bye, Sam! <laughs> they see you Thank next you. year! Bye, yeah. Gary, wherever you are! Yes. Chasing sheep. Bye! New Zealand. Say that. Bye. See you, mate! See you, guys! <laughs> that was a good job there, see you, mate! <laughs> You've got food all over your face. Mate. Wow, that place did not disappoint once again. Rosal Station, guys, you gotta get here. You gotta get here, do the Darling River Run in general, yes. but also come here and see these guys it's, and experience this. It's um, just amazing. as much the people who run it as everything that it's got to offer on the property. Uh, yeah. Can we and Betty come here tomorrow? No, we'll be back, I think. We'll be back, won't we? We'll be back maybe with a baby. Do you want to stay in or hop out? No, nah, leave her in Max to not even give her the option. Oh, okay. We're just going to wrap this up. Can you up. sing us a song, Zuri? Sing us a song while we wrap this up. Sing us a song. I can't. What a perfect spot to end this episode. Don't you reckon? It's all over Red Rover. It's not too far to Burke from here, so we're gonna we're gonna we'll we'll stop the. We've completely run out of all food and beverages, so we've got to we've got to <laughs> fill up. But guys, thank you for watching. Um, I hope we've inspired you to get out here and visit Outback New South Wales, mm -hmm. and uh, make sure you subscribe. Do it now. Because just a button so pause it now <laughs> end it now and just hit that subscribe thing please and we'll see you next time and comment and stuff and watch our next one Yeah. bye <laughs>